In this report, I'd like to talk a little bit about uh, remote test proctoring. As you all may be aware, uh, there is an option in the Tegrity lecture capture system uh, to do remote test proctoring, uh, but there has been some interest expressed um, through, from faculty through uh, means like the ATC or just in general conversations about exploring um, a remote testing proctor uh, vendor that could provide uh, the service for students on campus. And so we've been doing some exploration because you know there, there's been a lot of advancement, a lot of change in, in, in this area over, over the years. And um, one of the d downsides of using the Tegrity system as a remote test proctoring system is that it's up to the instructor to go back and review uh, any exam where they feel that there was maybe some potential cheating going on or, or some issues that they want to review. And then you have to go back and kind of review the, the full video, which can be an hour or two, depending on the length of the exam. Um, so. So I'll post some questions uh, um, that we have, uh, that I have about uh, exploring remote test proctoring, but I wanted to kind of just do a brief overview of kind of this, the level of service that is um, available out there. Um, so uh, this, this first uh, vendor is Software Secure. And so they, it's a $15 per student uh, per test fee. They, um, they record and then the company reviews the recordings and then they give you, um, give you feedback once the, they've had a chance to review the recordings. Um, you'll see here that they have a, a device uh, that is used, it's a biometric, so they, it scans the fingerprint and then it does a 360 degree view of the room and does audio. And so that's, I think that's a required component for this. Um, another, another vendor, another example is Proctor 101. Uh, this is a live uh, proctoring environment, so people, they log into the system and then uh, somebody is watching them take the test. And um, it ranges from $14 to $25 per exam. And students have to make an appointment and they're only available uh, Monday through Friday from 1 to 3 p.m., so it's a very limited availability. Um, then there's uh, online proctoring with Proctor U. Um, they're another live vendor where somebody is watching uh, the instructor or watching the student take the test. Um, they have 20 hours per day, seven days a week. Um, they can schedule an appointment or students can pay an additional fee to do kind of an, a quick uh, uh, proctored uh, exam. And those range from $875 uh, to $25 uh, per exam. And then another vendor that we've looked at is Proctor Cam. And they're also another live uh, proctoring vendor. Uh, Monday through Saturday, 8, 8 a.m. to 11 p.m., so they have uh, uh, more availability than, than Proctor 101, but not as much as Proctor U. Um, and they range from uh, 27, or it looks like it's uh, 2750 for the two hours, um, and then there's a cost for additional hours. Uh, so there is a co uh, quite a bit of cost associated with, with these tools. Um, and we do currently pay, uh, I believe it's $10 a student, or maybe it's $5 a student, um, uh, to, the, to the testing center here on campus uh, for students to, to take exams, uh, to have exams proctored. Um, the one downfall there is that it's, it's, it's a physical location, and so students have to come to campus. And we do have students that are all over the country um, taking online classes. Um, so I'll post some questions and discussion topic ideas, um, but this is um, beca slowly becoming a, a more requested um, thing to, to offer on campus is to have some kind of remote test proctoring capability.